Love yourself. Love yourself. Hey y'all, like I said, I was going to show y'all a little bit about, my, about uh, taking a little bit of my weight, uh, what I do when I, I'm doing the weights here at the house. Try to make this video quick, but y'all know, you know, you watching my videos, you don't never know what you're gonna get. You know, this could be a 15 minute or 15 minute. Or. All right, I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of my stretching. I've already stretched and stuff, but I'm gonna show you guys a little bit. And I know that the quality of the camera is probably gonna be a little dark, but just kind of bear with me because the sun is going down and they're painting and shit out here. And um, no, I don't have on the right shoes. But, you know, my, I'm, I'm lazy today, okay? And this is my lazy day. I haven't been feeling good all week. I'm kind of getting back on it. I've had a virus. I've been growing up, yada, yada, yada. I'm doing this for my YouTube channel here. You know, let us know what I do. You get down with my weight. Okay. What I do when I start stretching, I'm starting to kind of warming up my legs inside area because, believe it or not, there's a weight on me. I've got a lot. I mean, there's low in my arm. You know, I basically do this real quick. I'm just telling you guys that real quick to hold it for about 15, 15, 20 seconds. I get good stretches in. I do this way, 15, 20 seconds. You know, behind the arm, um, behind the neck. 15, 20 seconds. 15, 20 seconds. Check it out. Check it out. I just hit my hand. It hurt, but I'm cool. Check it out. And I got on like two or three, what, three shirts. You guys, because I, I like to sweat in the car. I like to sweat. What did she say? Ooh, what you say? Ooh, that you only meant well, well, cause you did. Ooh, what you say? Ooh, that it's all for the best, cause it is. Was so wrong, wrong for so long, long Only trying to please myself, myself. Girl, I, I was, was caught up in I'm house. stretching last for about 15 minutes Because I make sure everything is all stretched out in my body Because I'm not trying to hurt myself I'm not trying to be down for the count for a couple months Because I pull from you know So stretching is very, very, very important, everybody I'm sure a lot of you guys know that, but I always have to argue when I'm giving that demonstration. But what I'm using right now, like I said, excuse the patio because it is a mess. They are painting here, and so everything is just packed and pushed and fucking everything. Yeah, this is 30 pounds, including the bar. 30 pounds, including the bar, okay? And what I do is when I get started, I bend my knees. Or Pick the weight up, and I'm coming straight up. So I start with my feet and my legs together, and all I'm doing is pumping at the bottom. Not really bending my back, but I'm kind of like, I have my knees kind of bent, and I'm kind of like, my shoulders are kind of in. So I'm just kind of pushing like that, right there. Real, real easy, just like that. And I'm doing 20. I don't know where my count is. That's about 20, and then I go long with it. Just like this, legs push together. I'm bringing down to the belly button, up to right under the cheek. Breathe. Spread the legs open. I'm going to bring the bar up like this. And all you're going to do is bump it like you did the bottom. You just bump it. So I'm bringing my right up here to the chin and just straight out and just bump it. Right here. So this is working the back arm. The back flap. This is what you said. That was about 20. But I'm doing the short ones like this. This is helping to get through working the back flap, and we all don't like it. I'm doing the long 
from the navel up to under the chin. Let's work in this one. I know the muscle right here. The one I'm trying to work on my bottom arm. Tattooing. I'm working out right there. Jay, close that door for me. And um, when I'm doing the... Wait, I'll give you something in a second. When I'm, work, when I'm uh, bumping it on the bottom, like that, that's working the top, the shoulders. You know what I'm saying? So as I'm doing my workout, like that right there was considered a set. That was one set. And I did, what, 60? So I'm doing 60 more muscles right here. I worked my shoulders. I worked on my horseshoe, what I'm trying to get to. And I've also worked my back class. Okay? So we can say five sets of six. Five sets of 60. And then I get these weights, the same weights. You know, of course, pick it up properly, and don't forget to breathe, especially when you're using these weights, man, because you're tearing the weight. I mean, you're tearing your muscle to build muscle. Remember that. You are literally, the soreness that you feel after you're done using weights, it's because you have torn your muscle, but you tore, you tore your muscle in, in the right spot, in the right area to build the muscle and burn the fat. You know, so when you're sore after working out or whatever, no, you did a good, you did a good thing. Now, if you're definitely sore, like, hey, something is fucking wrong with me, then you fucked up, you know? All right, so here we go. I know my game just probably started. What I do is, if, um, I don't have a job here to help me to get this on my shoulders. What I do is I make sure I have my butt against the wall like this so I can get a good grip. Like I said, dude, when I do this job, man, I, I try not to get hurt. I don't want to get hurt. I don't want to get injured. Injured. So you want to prevent injuries at all costs because that will fuck you up from going to work, taking care of your kids, everything, your whole day in life. You know, so what I do is I get up against this wall, get the weight up, and you know, make sure I'm comfortable. Up the cover, back of my head. I'm still stabilizing the wall, so I'm able to get right up. Hey, you got to look at it and be like, yeah, ha, ha, ha. I'm telling you, fuck up and do it, do it the wrong way. You'll be making a YouTube video from the hospital bed. You know what I'm saying? If you're around here living, say it ain't no joke. I've seen people that have been working out that fuck they self up, man, and gained weight back and all that hard work because they can't do nothing. It's serious. Stretching is serious. You have to stretch. Drink the water. Do what you got to do. You don't want to injure it. Okay? So I have the weights right here, and you can also use shoulder pads and whatever, stuff like that. Make sure you got an excellent grip. And what I do, what I'm doing is I'm doing squats. With this extra weight, the 30 pounds on my shoulder, it's called resistance. I'm burning more. I'm building more muscle. Okay? So what I'm doing is I'm going down, I'm doing two. Okay? But I'm doing, I'm breaking it off in two seconds, and I'll show you. I'm doing it low, and I'm doing high. Ready? Yeah, here I go. Seven. I got all the pressure on the back of my heel. I feel it all in my inner thigh. Oh my God, it's burning already. You know, that's basically what I, uh, that was 20. And I usually do about five sets of these as well. Okay. Like I said, I'm comfortable. Got the weight down, and I'm able to set these down. Just like that. And then with these, I'll do it as well. What I'm doing is kind of like the same thing I do with the regular um, the long bar. I'm doing the same thing with the short arm, just on, on the short arm, the short, the dumbbell with the one arm. Okay? I'm starting low, and I'm counting 20. One. I do 20, and when I automatically, I'm going into the long, uh, the long line. Bring it all the way up to the top of my boot, and down to about my kneecap. I'm doing 20 of these, okay? This is about, what is this, uh, I think this is about 25 pounds, if I'm not mistaken. Could be 20. I don't, I don't remember the exact count. All right, so I do 20 of those and go right into short arms at the top, okay? Right into that. So you're right here, just pumping it. Just pumping it. That's all I'm doing. Now just showing you guys a little bit of example of what I'm doing. What I'm doing, what I'm doing right y'all, may seem, may seem when, uh, when Chanik, 
But the thing is, is that I'm actually working my abs out using a dumbbell. Because while you're doing that, you're engaging your abs. You're holding in your abs while you're pressing. You're holding in your abs as you're going down. So you're engaging your abs the whole time, y'all. So you're working out your arms and you're working out your abs at the same time. That's why I love doing the dumbbell exercise. When I'm doing the short ones like this, I know you guys know exactly what I'm working when I'm doing this. You want the short arm? I'm working the back. I'm working the back of my arm. When I'm doing the long ones, like this, I don't know if I'm working the back, but when I'm doing that, I'm not sure I'm working the front. When I'm puffing on the short, I'm working my shoulders and my chest. I'm doing it on both, I'm doing both sides. I switch both sides. When I do both arms, I do one set. I do five of them. Alright? You guys take it easy. God bless. You keep it pushing. You know, your girl is always here for you. Just stay here for me. I'm on your team to stay on my team. And I ain't even got to say it. Y'all already know. So I'm just going to say it anyway. Keep pushing. At 100%. And all that you do.